joining me for another shave, a head shave, the first head shave for 2022. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. You're a month school friends. Right, what are we using? As you can see from the thumbnail, Phoenix Artisan Equipment Harvest Moon. Beautiful scent. And this is not in the CK6 formula, it's in the original, it's a shea butter. It's slick enough guys, but I have got a cube to pre-shave. There's the paw. Excuse me if I've got a bit of snivels, I've got a bit of a cold coming. But at least I can smell this, it's beautiful. The notes in this are Ode, Green Tobacco, Black Currant, Smoke, Tobacco Absolute, Peru Balsam, Spanish moss and white sage. You get the old, the tobacco's there. Not getting any black currants, the smoke, the sage and the moss I get. It's an absolute perfect blend. And Doug goes to extreme lengths to uh, get the sense right. He puts in a lot of work. And uh, very much appreciated, Doug, what you do for the community. Thank you very much. Fantastic scent. You'd like this one, Mark. Right, I whipped that up in my Karatikus bowl. Sorry about the lighting, guys. I've been playing around with the camera. Let me know if the uh, picture and the lighting's okay. I've been messing around with a few settings. And I've whipped it up with my Razorock. My Razorock beehive. Is that the right way? Yeah. Razorock Beehive, huge, 30 millimeter tuxedo knot. Cracking peaks on that, and I'm gonna pre-shave the cube. I'm gonna shave the head with my go-to razor, and it's the leaf, guys. It's an outstanding head shaver, in my own personal opinion. It's the best, or one of the best head shavers on the market. And we're going to be using a Sunny Superior Stainless Blade for its first use. And to load the blade, this screw here, undo that, and it releases three compartments. There's one, there's two, and there's the third. But I'm only going to be using the the bottom one and the middle one on this, and to load the blade, snap it, fold it in half with the wrapper on, so you don't slice your fingers until you hear it snap. I hope you heard that. <laughs> and then take it out the wrapper. Carefully. And then load the blade. Now, when you load it, the compartments have these um, retaining studs on each end. Let me turn this light down, guys, because it, it looks a bit glary to me. They have retaining studs on each end, and it's the same on the different compartments. And the edge of the blade rests on them. Show you now. Just like that. Can you see that? I hope so. And they are magnetic so that the blades don't move as you're loading. There's the second one. Then all we do is close the flap, keep the pressure on the flap on the top, push the button up, and then tighten up. It's as easy as that, guys. Check the alignment, everything's perfect. Right, let's wet the head, apply the cube, and let's get shaving. I want a bit warmer than that. <laughs> Apologies if the um, Video goes on a bit longer. I'm, I'm just gonna relax with this. It's my first head shave this year. I haven't done it for a while. So 
I was, I normally wait to do the head as it gets a little bit warmer towards the spring. Just do my head in, guys. I want to try and make it a regular thing because I, I always buzz cut my hair, which I've already done. I always buzz cut it and have it as short as possible throughout the year. It's even getting the time to do that. I, I said to myself, right, make time to get it shaved because it makes you feel better. So it's good for my mental health, if you like. Yeah, forgive me if I've got a bit of a snivel. It's not COVID. Me and Mrs. B have been tested, so excuse me while I blow my nose. A train coming. <laughs> right, let's get laughing. Yeah, Mrs. B started feeling unwell. And she had symptoms. She had a little bit of a temperature, dry cough. Um, felt weak so we got test kits from work which they provide now which is absolutely fantastic the lather on this guy you can see the sheen absolutely beautiful and I want to get this head shaving now so while I can smell the scent it's, it's a bit of a cologne scent it's a it's a comforting scent Stent, strength even though I'm getting a cold I'll put it about a six. Easy. Look at this, guys. Get some heat in the razor. Yeah, she had the symptoms. I felt absolutely fine. So we took our test and they were negative. Turns out it's just a little bit of a cold. Right, here we go, guys. First head shave for 2022. Let's go right down the middle first. The leaf razor. Absolutely outstanding head shaver. Now you can fully load it in the three compartments. I've done that once and to be honest with you I didn't really notice any difference than the two. It's very agile. I love the pivot on it and it stays to the contours of your skull. Doing the job great, and these blades feel so smooth. They remind me a little bit like the RK blades. From India. I think these are from India as well. For all I know, they could be from the same the same company. But they're a great blade. Not expensive either. I'll leave a link in where I can in the description below. If you click on show more and scroll down, it'll show everything that I've used. I always put a full description in the description. <laughs> on the head it's very very comfortable been looking forward to this couldn't come soon enough a lot of hairs there guys Blades are working exceptional. Let's just get make sure I get all that neck out of here. Normally when I when I used to have a shave and cut my hair, I used to get Mrs. Beats just to do my neckline. She doesn't do it anymore. I don't know why. Maybe because I, if I asked she'd do it. But she knows that. I shave my head now. 
I had to do a pretty good job at the back of my head even though I can't see it. Cushion on the soap is excellent on the head. I love PAA soaps. I love Ariane and Evan soaps as well. They're exceptional. And you can tell, not just within the quality of the soap, but when you use them, you just know the work that's gone into them. You can feel it through the results. That's great. Stay. I've been dropping in the sink. <laughs> I'm gonna keep, when I've been laughing enough, that's a great first pass, guys. So many of you head shavers, what are you using today? Let me know your shaves of the day. I don't know why I did that, I haven't got the other t-shirt on. <laughs> the other one's got SMTD on it. Never mind. Yeah, let me know what you're using, guys. I need to get back into the head shaves. It's... Um, if any of you guys are thinking about doing it, just do it. It's amazing how liberating you feel when you've shaved your head. Especially in the summer. Keeps your head cool. Make sure you bottom up properly. But what I love about second pass guys, what I love about shaving the head in the summer is that feeling of a cold pillow when you go to bed. There's nothing like it. I must be mad doing this because we're having a really cold spell in North Wales, in the UK where I live. It's been in the minuses. I think it was Minus four yesterday where I live. When I was in work last week, Friday and Saturday, on the delivery I was on, was minus seven for both days. I was shaving my head. <laughs> Not that it matters. But some of you might think I'm mad. This is beautiful. A lot of hair still coming off. It's doing a fantastic job. Don't frown when you're doing this bit. Don't, in case, because the blade will catch. When you're doing the back of your neck, keep your, your chin to your chest and stretch the skin. This is excellent. My trouble area is my crown because it's like a swirl. Really annoying. So if you've got a trouble area, let me know how you deal with it when you're shaving. Got a trouble crown. Any tips will be appreciated. How's your head shaves going, Craig? You haven't posted anything or praise on YouTube for a while, mate. You let me down. <laughs> I know we've all been busy over the Christmas period.
Should have worn some that and have a feel. Wow. Yeah, especially there, I've missed quite a bit. That just, just there, I've made, missed quite a bit. So I'll do that first on the next pass. Hopefully, it'll be the final pass before the uh, the tidy up. Like I say, I apologise if it goes on a bit long. Guys, you can always fast forward. It's been a while since I've done one. The head always takes longer anyway. It's a big area. Bit. Right, let's get that bit that I've missed. Oh yeah, you can feel it when I've missed it. You can really feel it with this razor, it gives great feedback in the feel. I wouldn't say it's like a squeak where there's nothing left, but you know what I mean. No. That's better. Don't want to cut myself now. Yeah, my hair on my head grows in all kinds of different directions. It's, it's really awkward. Right, that feels really smooth there now. This feels great, guys. I don't know why I waited. I should have kept just shaving it. It's time. It's a time thing, especially Christmas. My job, for those of you who don't know, I'm a postman with Royal Mail. I have been for 19 years. Um, come October, the end of October, it starts getting really crazy. Getting home late. Sometimes too tired to cook and eat. So hence, too tired to shave. I do the face shaves, do enough of them as it is. Lay here on the neck now. So what's the weather like where you are? I know from places in the States and Canada they've been having really heavy snow. Is it snow bombs? What they call it? Like a big snow storm. Do you know what guys, I could get away with that. But I'm going to use the last of this to have a feel. Just a little bit there. There's practically nothing there guys. That's exceptional. Blades are fantastic. Ow, water's a bit hot. So let's go for the uh, final touch ups. Neck grows crossways. Oh, 
I don't know how these guys do it like 15 minutes. I like to take your time. Enjoy the experience. I'm not just trying a quick video on it. Because that's not the shave. Unless you don't absolutely rush if you if you're doing something important or you gotta go somewhere. Savour it, enjoy it. It's your time in the den. There's nobody in here but us. Do you know what? I I thought when I was going back I might have pressed a little hard. I don't know why. Well hey go. It was almost perfect, but that's nothing. The scent and the performance on this soap is amazing. PAA's Harvest Moon. It's not a strong tobacco scent, but it's there, it's pleasant. It, Great all around the um, same like cold water in the guys. Alan block. Get it on that cut. Fancy just catching myself right in the last bit. There's absolutely nothing, there's no sting, not even where that little nick is, guys. There's no sting whatsoever. That is beautiful. It feels great. Rinse that off. It's almost squeaking. Fresh towel. That feels great. Because I haven't done it for a while as well, I'm going to put a witch hazel on. I'm going for Thayer's unscented. I need a little bit. Get as much astringent and goodness into the scalp as possible. Look, it's squeaking, guys. That's how close it was. Aftershave, splash, it, it's got to be the matching splash. Harvest Moon. Always pour out of these on the side because they have the tendency to run down the label and you don't want to ruin your labels guys see see how it runs that smells amazing very cologne very warm you can smell the smokiness in the um, in the aftershave more than the soap boom I'm going to put my specs on for this one. Boom! I'm going for Raw Naturals. Mr. Cool. And it's... This refreshing aftershave balm helps fight post-shaving dryness, razor burn and redness. Mentholated. So it'll cool the head down a bit. If you don't drop it. Sounds a bit watery, but I haven't used it for a while. See how it pours. Oh no, it's fine. There you go, guys. Should be enough. Only a slight fragrance to this. I mean, that's like a cologne as well. Fresh. Make sure you get the log holes. 
and that's it guys. Thank you so much for joining me for my first head shave for 2022. I enjoyed that. <laughs> right. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of your week. I'll see you on Friday for the face shave. If not, have a fantastic rest of the week, guys. Stay smooth and stay safe. Take care. Bye now.